Hey guys, I'm Mr. Freddy here, and today it's going to be a brand new LEGO review, uh, sort of, because I just got this, I managed to own this set back in 2016, I think, which is a LEGO Ninjago set from the Skybound Wave, which is called Call of Dragon, which set number is 70599, and it has 98 pieces, and it's for ages 6 to 14. Structure manual, uh, Quite small, which has a total of 33 pages, step, steps to build. And here's the advertisement for the, the Skybound wave of the Jago. So, okay, it's sets and uh, website. <coughs> and it's pretty much it. Also, the win ad with featuring the Green Ninja, okay, Lloyd. So, yeah. So, first minifigure is. <coughs> Call which you know he has the any colors of the of gray and black you know which is mostly you know mostly gray is the dominant color on this figure and he has some in a nice uh, a nice uh, front front printing right there and some leg printing so just instant and also he has the also Cole has the the little golden scythe weapon I don't need to get a focus in. Close enough, so yeah, did this. Also, he carries. Also, he has the flag on his back, which I think it meant said Cole in Japan, but I don't know. So yeah, and also, let me take off this piece. So we're gonna just for the yeah. yeah sometimes he's sometimes he's a. I think sometimes he's usually stuck. So, oh, there it goes. There it goes. And here's the back printing, which has a nice little. Symbol, which I think meant cold in Japan, and here's the space. And let me put everything back together for coal with that flag in it. So here it is, here he is. and okay. pretty good figure for coal, possibly right during the, the 2014 coal from the other small Ninjago set. And also, next is the one of the pirate uh, troopers, which I forgot his name since I didn't even watch the very watch the Ninjago TV. Yes, the Ninjago TV series. So, yeah. So he has he has pretty good uh, printing, you know, on the front and leg printing, which has uh, two different colors: one orange on the right and the green on the right. And and, and so it looks he looks nice, and also nice looking back printing and the. Different different colors on the on the legs, so yeah, and it's coming with this little pirate hat and nope nope double sided face and those say it's just like the call figure, so yeah. And also equipped with the little traditional pirate gun and this cool looking sword, you know, which has the little, the skull skull on the, on the front, so yeah. And also looks looks dangerously sharp, so yeah, so that's the, the pirate trooper, so that's that and also it's also, there's uh, this little collectible f item, which <clears throat> one of the, the spirit swords, you know, which is, this one is ice, which has Zane's face on it. So nothing special. It's just it's just the little collectible item, but it has like a nice looking uh, piece, which is only for the for this wave, which is still has a skull in it. So yeah, and also there's little axe pieces, which looks interesting sharp. So yeah. <clears throat> and now for the main thing, which is the Cole's dragon, and yeah, he look. It looks like he looks. Re it looks rather strange in a good way, you know. <clears throat> Has like pretty good, good amounts of uh, green, some green piece, some green colors on the on the slope pieces, and the, the gold on the little claws, you know, which is on these gold claws and. Like mostly dark brown and yeah, sometimes so so much brown is actually is a dominant color for this this small creature and also the face yeah it looks rather weird and the jaw uh it's mostly just move rather awkwardly but you can kind of like like just like move it slightly but you can't like open like close it but. Because it might cause the the piece to pop off and 
And this looks like, like great. There's not like, like some empty space spaces on these on this piece, which kind of bothers me. And <clears throat> you notice know, these little hero factory pieces, which I think is for the invented from below sets. And yeah, just, seriously, I feel like the only one who thinks this is, looks like a more a more amped up uh, Mixel figure, you know, like Fleur. That's a little more earth element than the ice element. So yeah, and also you can like. There's like a little saddle right there, which you can, yeah, right there. He can like sit cold there, so we can take a ride on his dragon, which is pretty cool. Seriously, this is actually w weird in a good way. So yeah, so yeah, so when I think about this set, um, it's pretty good, and especially that this cool looking dragon, you know, which has some possible wings and the arms and the, the feet and legs and the tail which move it like like this so yeah so so yeah a pretty good set was which in a which looks weird but in a good way so yeah so what am i making on this set mm, i should give it like a 7.8 out of 10 because it looks good and all but in a with some weirdness, which kind of makes it looks good and good looking minifigures in this nice little collectible piece, but it doesn't mean anything. But <clears throat> yeah, so that was my review on Cole's Dragon from the Lego Ninjago Skybound Wave. So yeah, guys. So hope you guys have a a rather nice day and uh, see you for more. See you for more. Few from see you for more videos like tomorrow, you know, for this week. So yeah, so stay tuned for another Lego review like next week, hopefully. So um, goodbye. Yeah.